Long time ago, in ancient Japan, there lived a renowned samurai named Yamaka Teshu. Known for his exceptional swordsmanship and deep yearning for spiritual wisdom, Teshu embarked on a transformative journey across the land, seeking enlightenment from various Zen masters. During his travels, fate led Teshu to the tranquil Shikoku Temple, where he unexpectedly encountered a wise monk named Dokyuan. With curiosity and eagerness in his heart, Teshu approached the master, hoping to display his understanding of Zen. In a confident yet humble tone, Teshu proclaimed, The mind, the Buddha, and all beings are empty. The true nature of all things is emptiness. There is no enlightenment, no delusion, no sages, no commoners, no toil, no reward. Impressed by Teshu's eloquence, Dokyuan regarded him with a serene smile. Instead of engaging in a philosophical debate, the master chose a different approach. He invited Teshu to join him for a cup of tea in the temple's peaceful garden. As they sat beneath the shade of a cherry blossom tree, Dokyuan poured tea into Teshu's cup. The aroma filled the air, captivating their senses. Teshu eagerly awaited the master's response, expecting to be praised for his profound insight into Zen. With a calm voice, Dokyuan spoke, Enlightenment is not an attainment, Teshu. It is a homecoming, a return to the core of your being. It is a realization that the extraordinary lies within the ordinary. Teshu's brows furrowed in confusion, his mind racing to grasp the essence of Dokyuan's words. The master continued, in your pursuit of enlightenment, have you ever considered that it is not about becoming something extraordinary? It is about recognizing the inherent simplicity and beauty within yourself and all that surrounds you. As the cherry blossoms gently danced in the breeze, Teshu pondered Dokyuan's wisdom. Suddenly, he realized the profound truth hidden within the master's teachings. It was not about attaining lofty ideals but rather about embracing the present moment and finding contentment within it. A sense of tranquility washed over Teshu's being, dissolving the complexities that had once burdened his soul. The grandeur of enlightenment was not found in profound words or intellectual debates. It lay in the humble awareness of the here and now. From that day forward, Teshu's perspective shifted. He no longer sought enlightenment as a distant goal but as a continuous journey, woven into the fabric of his everyday life. Each action, no matter how mundane, became an opportunity to connect with the extraordinary essence of existence. Word by word, Teshu's understanding spread throughout the land. People marveled at his ability to infuse even the simplest tasks with grace and purpose. His teachings transcended the boundaries of samurai and commoners, touching the hearts of all who sought wisdom. The tale of Yamaka Teshu and his encounter with the monk Dokyuan serves as a reminder that enlightenment is not an unattainable treasure but a timeless homecoming. By embracing the ordinary, we can unlock the extraordinary within ourselves and bring harmony to our lives.